It's been seven years since I got married to this man. These seven years have been seven years of suffering, accusation, infidelity, and so much more. In these years, I've lived a life of a child. A life of a mother, and most especially, the life of a hated wife. I cannot understand the reason Yet, I am determined to live with him because of the children that God Almighty has given to us. And the vows we took before God to live together until death to us. Good evening, baby. How was your day? Where are the children? Are they sleeping? Children, mommy's back. Children. Mommy is back. Baby. Did you pick up the children as I asked you to, please? You must be very stupid to ask me such questions. Are you out of your senses? Out of my senses? For asking you to pick up your own children? Baby, why now? Why? I told you that I'll be going for extra moral classes after school. That's the only way I can raise money to take care of the children, for feeding and upkeep and other things, because you refuse to give money for their upkeep. After the extra moral classes, it's late. I didn't want them waiting in school for me. It's still that late. That's why I asked you when you come back, just stop by and pick them up. Baby, why? Hey. The next time you open your mouth to ask me such silly questions, that will be the last day that you will use this mouth. I will make sure that's the last thing you will ever say with this mouth. You're very stupid. Now I've become your errand boy. You want me to go and pick up kids from the school? Then what would you be doing? What would you be doing? You have taken your modern responsibilities and you're putting it on me. <laughs> try it next time. Just try it next time. Go punish you there.
I know, I know. Chidera, please, eh? Please, please. Let's hurry and pick up your brother. He must also be hungry and tired. See, let's hurry up, okay? Please, when we get home, I'll give you food to eat, okay? Okay. Okay? Okay. Let's hurry up and pick up your brother, okay? Ah, God. Please hurry up now, hurry up. Maybe your food is ready. By the time I am done with you in this house, you would wish you were dead. You would honestly wish you were dead. Peter, Peter, but you just can't let it go. I just hope that you'll be alright. Such a bitter pill, but you just can't let it go. Oh. I just hope that you will be alright When that fever comes up at the midnight I just hope that you will be alright When the rain comes pouring in the morning Mom, what happened? Um, the plate slipped from my hand. <sighs> Broke. You're crying, Mom. <sighs> you just said that the plate broke. Uh, did you both enjoy your meal? Yes, Mom. You know what? It's time to shower. Let's go inside and have your bath so you can sleep and go to school tomorrow, okay? All right, you two should just wait for me in the room. I'm coming to bathe you, okay? Let me clean up this mess, okay? Okay. Yeah. 
Let's go, good. Yes, 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 my son. You don't worry, just lie down small and then sleep with your sister, okay? All right, sleep the other side, okay? Mm, all right, let's just lie down and tell a story, okay? So, let's pray. Do we pray? All right, pray for us, okay? Amen. Amen. I just hope that you will be alright. Keep going, keep going, everything is gonna be alright. After extra moral classes, it's late. I didn't want them waiting in school for me. Baby, why? Hey! By the time I am done with you in this house, you would wish you were dead. You would honestly wish you were dead. Oh, my is supposed to be gone. 
Please help me, God. Please help me, God. Please help me. <laughs> Once beaten, twice shy. I've been through this too many times in my life not to fall for them again. Even now, as an adult. Hey, I am like, so happy that we I are finally so done with happy, school. Like, I God, like after all the old stress, like God, so we are like, done with school, eh? I swear, oh, so I can't, like I cannot school. believe it. Like Do you know that I can't believe that we are finally done with school. Even me too, oh, like I cannot believe it. Hey, like, eh? see, when we started, mm. I thought it would not end. Ah, yesterday, yesterday, oh, now we be this. Now we be this, oh, so my friend. Like school. mother exam was tough. Hey. I was like I was sweating. <laughs> <laughs> hey. We are done with As school. As we are done, no, go. wait, 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 miracle. What are your plans now that we are done with high school? My sister, I don't know. I've been thinking, Sha. Mm -hmm. I'm thinking that maybe I'll go and visit my brother and my sister in the city. That's nice. Mm. I wish I was like you, who have people in the city. Uh -uh. You don't have any uncle or auntie or even distant relative in the city? No. Maybe you should ask your mommy or your daddy. We don't now. have. Don't have. <laughs> Anyways, my mom said that it is good for a mother to raise her child because she incorporates moral values, traditional Kong values, cultural values that the child will never lose. Why? But I just said it now. Please, I'm tired. Let's go home. Wait, 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 wait. See, eh? my mom says she's going to make a falco mm. with cow head. Mm. Do you want to come to the house? I'm not coming. My mom is making a goosey for me with the sheer wood. Eh, mm, so yeah. now we are doing competition. Yes, yeah, so you are not like... your own face. <laughs> <laughs> Daddy, come here. What's your name since we finished the team? Thank you. Miracle. 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 Yes, Mama. Come and pack all these places. Daddy just finished the team. Thank you, Mama. Yeah. We just try. Abby? You see the guy now who is Abby, she is even trying, eh? She's a very good girl. She's going up to be a very nice good girl. She's managed money to manage the country is all about. Papa? Please, uh, you don't have to worry about it. Mm -hmm. um, Please, I wanted to discuss something important here. I hope Paul is well. Yes, Mama. You know, I just finished secondary school and I have time before my result comes out. So I was just thinking that I'd like to go to Lagos to visit brother Obiora and sister Ada and spend time with them for a while, depending when my results will come out and also have an experience of Lagos a little bit. What for? Mama, I just said so now that I want to go and experience the city life. You know, I was born here and I've lived all my life here. I don't even know how people live there and any, everything that happened there. I just want to, you know, go and experience Lagos life a little bit. I've heard so much about the city and the opportunities that are there. So I want to go and see how it is like experiencing and know for myself so that I can be better prepared for the future. Mm -hmm. My husband, you heard what your daughter said. What do you feel about it? Um, she has made her mind clear to us, so we we'll sleep over it. Papa, uh, does that mean it's a yes? Yes, I have not disagreed. As I said, 
will sleep over it. Your mother and I will get back to you. Okay. I have, it's okay, Papa. Thank you very much. Thank sleep you. very Thank well, you. Papa. Thank you. Thank you. Right, good Thank night. You. Good night. Oh, you are so excited. Seems like he just won a jackpot. Hey, my sister, she for me first. This one is more than jackpot. Share me the good news. Hey, <laughs> share me, share me, share me, share me. Hey, you are so uh, My uh, friend, you are so afraid. What? What? Uh, like, it seems like he just won a jackpot. Uh, Come see, on, I told my parents about my me wanting to go to the city, and they allowed me. They said I can go. Hmm, this is good news indeed. It's though. good news. <laughs> yeah. Hey, they said I can. What is it? Ah, why is your face like this now? I'm just sad that you're about to lead me to the city soon. Straighten your face, Biko. I'm your friend now. You're my best friend. Don't worry, I will not forget you. Are you sure? I'll always call you. It's only you'll be calling, you know. Are you sure you keep to your word? Yes, now. Okay. Is that why your face is like this? <laughs> is my face is like that, my friend. <laughs> Don't worry, I'll be calling you. I'll give me all the gist of what is happening in the city. So let me see you now. <laughs> I, I'm just coming now. I thought that you came. Go inside share. the house and bring me something. Yeah, I don't have any water. I don't have anything. I don't, you, you always want to take something. I'll go and get it myself. Hey, I just say I did because. Okay, um. Hey, hey, I did, I did miracle. So, yeah. you have always been a good girl. Hey, Papa. That is my main reason of staying. You should stay in the village until you are done with your high school. Um, you should you make sure we did not uh, do anything wrong that will make your brother regretting of inviting you to come to Lagos. Yes, Papa. I promise that I will not do anything to disappoint you and Mama. I promise. Um, that is my daughter talking. Mama Mira, could you have anything to... Nothing much, you said, said it all. I trust our daughter. She's always a good teacher. Ah, thank you so much, Mama. See, let me rush out. Once yeah, I get to Lagos, I'll let the both of you know that I've arrived. That is all. Right. I'll call. Thank you, Mama. Thank you, <laughs> thank you Papa. Uh -huh. Bye bye. Go well, go well. Okay. Well, well, well. <laughs> my beloved sister, so good to see you in the city. Yes, it's so good to see you too, brother. <laughs> it's so good to see you. Yeah. So tell me, how is everyone in the village? Everybody's fine. Oh, Papa and Mama, they're fine. Okay. And um, I hope they're healthy. Ah, everybody's healthy. Just Papa was not feeling too fine. And uh, I think Asha is okay now. Thank God. Uh, how come nobody told me? Papa had mentioned that nobody should tell you because he didn't want to disturb you because of your new job. Uh, Papa should have known that my job cannot impede me from caring for my family now. Hmm? I always take care of my family no matter what. He would have told me at least. But it's okay, the most important thing is that you're here now and yes. they are fine. Yeah, fine. Mm. So don't worry. Okay. I'm sure everything will be fine. Yes. Let me take you home, okay? Okay. You need some rest. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Ah, my beloved sister. You are welcome to my small place. Uh, Welcome. I mean, this is where we are managing for now. Brother, mm -hmm. you call this place small? Of course it is. And you are managing this place? Yes. No, no, this place is not small. Uh, <laughs> it's a small place. I mean, my mates are living in bigger houses. It's small. Hey! <laughs> well, this one past management to see, see your big TV. <laughs> this one, eh? Someone can enter inside it too. Really? Could I see? See everywhere. See, hey, hey, my sister. 
It's management. Management. Mm -hmm. See, the only thing remaining now is mm -hmm. for you to get married. Ah, oh, I know. This is what every mother and every sister will say. Eh? But you know what? The truth of the matter is that I've not seen any good girl. There's no good girl anywhere. That's why I'm not, I'm not married yet. Well, don't worry, don't worry, don't worry. I'll take it upon myself to get you a good wife. Mm. Yes. Even when you don't know the city. Don't worry, I'll pass and pray. If that's what it takes to get you a good wife, we need a good wife. <laughs> pray for one to come. <laughs> hey, your place is beautiful. Okay, thank you. Okay, no problem until then, eh? For now, you need some rest. You know it's been a long journey. Eh? Let me take you to your room so that hey. you can rest and then after that, you know you have to make something for me to eat. I, brother, I brought plenty things. I'll give everything. I, yeah. Yes. Yeah, come now. Let me, let yeah, me take you to your room first so that you freshen up and then the food will follow. Mm? <laughs> come, come, come. Let's go. Mm -hmm. Okay, just um, serve it. I will come eat shortly. Let me see what what these boys are playing. Well, I come and eat now. Okay, uh, let me just eat. Else, I wanted to see how this match went because honestly, I think this uh, coach is not doing so well, and I'm not happy about him. I don't know what these boys are playing. Oh, well, brother, your food will get cold now. Eat your food. Okay, if you say so, let me just eat. All right. I know this food will sure be a delicious one. Okay. <laughs> All right. There you go. Mm. Mm. How do you like it? Hmm, this is so delicious. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, you are a wonderful cook, Aww. just like Mama. Thank you. <laughs> Thank You're you. Welcome. You're welcome. Um, you know what? Mm. When I have my kids, mm, I'm going to send them to the village so that they can learn some of these basic norms. And one of them is cooking. Yes. <laughs> just yes. Like you. Yes, I agree. I agree, brother. <laughs> Mm. But I want to ask you for something. Please, I want to go and visit Sister in Ikeja tomorrow. Uh, but it's barely a week since you've been here. I mean, well, why do you want to go and see her so soon? I mean, why don't you stay? Hmm? Brother, I'm just going to visit her. I'll go tomorrow, I'll come back the same tomorrow. No thing. It's okay. Um, if you say you want to go and visit her and come back same day, because obviously I don't want you to leave my side for anything in this world. <laughs> <laughs> but I'm not your wife, will be cool. You see the reason why you have to get married. You see? But I'll go and look for a wife at Mario. Because me, I cannot give you that kind of attention. Your wife can give you attention, sit down, do everything for you. Me, I'm not your wife, be cool. I know. I know. This is what you and Mama always tell me. <laughs> But in due time, I'm going to get married. Mm? Mm -hmm. That's the most important thing. Yes. Yes. Um, it's okay. Uh, if your mind is made up to go, uh, no problem. You you have my support. No oh, wow. um, Brother, mm -hmm. but I need transfer money. Okay. That's not a problem. Um, first thing in the morning tomorrow, as I'm going to walk, I'm going to give you the money. Okay? Okay. Thank you. Okay. Thank you. Mm. Why don't you come and join me? No, no, no. It's already. It's already. Mm. Yes. Okay. It's already. My beloved sister, you're such a wonderful cook. <laughs> mm. Don't worry. I'm just started, though. I'm just giving mm. you the basics. Mm. <laughs> wow. Okay. Nice.
Brother of your 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 Hey, what have you done? Gone out. Oh. What I told you, no, no. What did you do? Oh. I don't want to believe, but the obiora has gone to work without giving me the money for transport, like he promised. What do I do now? What do I do? I've already made up my mind to go visit Sister Ada today. Anyways, let me just get prepared and wait for him. Who knows? He might just return to give me the money. Greetings, young lady. Hi. Are you going to Maltu? I don't have any money on me to get to Maltu. Could this be God trying to help me by bringing this man? I could give you a ride if you don't mind. Come on. You're going my way. If you're going my way, I can give you a ride. I can give you a ride. Come on. Hop in, hop in, hop in. That's right. You're welcome. So, how are you today? So tell me, where Mao Tzu are you headed? Why don't you tell me where you are headed? I'm actually driving towards the Kedja. Are you serious? Sure. What a coincidence. You're going my way? I'm actually going to oh, Kedja too. Then relax. I shall get you to your destination. Okay, <laughs> great. Well, for me, it's getting too late to let a beautiful young, charming lady like you, alone in the streets of Lagos, there wouldn't be a gentleman enough for me to do that. So mm. feel free. Okay. Hello? Yeah, hello? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Just let everything remain as planned. Yeah, inclusive the room stay. Aha. Thank you very much. Oh, so, yeah, there's an emergency. I need to rush up to the office. I have the office gate with me, so I have to lock up. Don't worry, it won't be too long there. Instead of leaving you along a Kija busy road, I take you to your, straight to your sister. I don't, I don't mind to meet her. Do you mind? I wouldn't mind. Do you mind? Oh, I don't mind at all. You don't mind? Yes. That's cool. Uh, I like thank that. You. Thank you. Thank too. you too. Thank you very much. <laughs>
Help me out! Help me out! Help me out! Help me out! Please help me! Please, 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 please help me! Please, please help me! Please, go, 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 please go fast, go fast, go fast, please go fast. Is everything all right, Cindy? This man is actually from my side. Odima. I'm fine now. He looks harmless. Yeah. I must commend your bravery. Don't worry. Everything is fine now. Thank you, sir. I think I am in safe hands now. Come on. You don't have to cry. Wipe your tears. Everything is fine. You are safe now. I'm taking you to a safe place. Thank you, sir. Thank you. <laughs> oh. I've been standing here for only God knows how long, yet no boss to pick me. It's either they are full or they're not going my way. <sighs> I cannot continue to stand here. Maybe I should just walk back to the park. I'm sure it will be easy for me to get a bus over there, though it's a bit far, but I have to get there because standing here is not yielding any positive result. Where are you going? Good day, sir. Um, I'm actually waiting for a bus that will take me to Oshodi. Then I'll take another bus from Oshodi to Festa. Oh, Festa? Yes, sir. <laughs> Lucky you. Uh, come on in. I'll drop you off. <sighs> come on in. Don't worry, sir. No, no, no. Come on. I insist. I mean, you can't be standing here for this long. Come on. I'll drop you off. Okay, sir. Thank you, sir. You're welcome. So, where are you going dressed like this? Oh, I'm actually going to church in Festac. Oh, <laughs> what a coincidence. I'm also going to church uh, in Festac. Really? Yes. Yeah, I, I used to stay in um, Festac, but I had to look into a uh, day because of the nature of my work. Oh, wow. Are you a pastor? Do I look like one? <laughs> no, I'm not a pastor. Uh, why are you turning? You're supposed to go straight. Oh no, I'm trying to avoid the traffic. So, uh, it's an RPM way, very short. But don't worry, before you know, we'll, we'll go to Festa. Oh, I've never taken this road to Festa before. Oh, really? Well, now you know it. Now you know it.
So please, where are you taking me to? Uh, don't worry. I, I just want to drop something with a friend. It won't take long. Uh, then I'll take you to church. Uh, sir, please. I don't want to go with you. Please. You don't have anything to worry about. Don't worry. Don't worry. I'm late for church already. Please. I said I will take you to church myself. I don't, I don't feel good about this. Just come down, come down, come down. Where is this place? Just come down first. Sir, so what are we doing? I don't know. 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 I don't Stay here, don't go anywhere. I'm, I'm coming. Wait, why did we bring her here? That is a full of trouble. Please, take her away now. But you don't want to go to the house. You don't want to go to the house. Baba, full of trouble. How? How? Come with me, let's go. Sister Miracle, are you okay? Talk to me. Should I tell her what just happened to me? No. I think it's better I give the testimony in church so that others will learn from it. That it's not every car that offers you a lift that you should jump into. Where are you going to? Church. Church? But this is not the way to church. This is the direction to church. Let's get going. Third mass is starting very soon. Oh. Yeah, this way. Okay. Come on. Thank you. Thank you. It's okay. God bless you. <laughs> Sister Miracle, Sister Miracle, um, if you don't mind, I would like to give you a lift to your destination. No, I can't let this repeat itself. Now that I am an adult, a married woman for that matter, never, it won't happen. His face is not familiar at all. I could swear that I've never met him before. Sister Miracle, do not, uh, do not be afraid. I mean no harm. I understand that you're heading to school soon. Let me help you, give you a comfortable ride. Who are you? What do you want? How do you know my name? You don't have to know me for me to know you, okay? I know that you are a servant of God and that you deserve the very best. Listen. 
like I said earlier, you're on your way to school. Let me help you get to your destination. Who are you? And how do you know where I'm going? Sister Miracle, you are a servant of God. And I have been watching you for a very long time now. We used to attend the same church before you, you left. I'd like to repeat again, I understand that you're heading to school. Let me help you. I have been waiting for the perfect opportunity, the appointed time for us to cross paths. Thankfully, that is happening today. Remember what God said to Paul when he was going through trials and tribulation. In an accepted time, I have heard you. In the days of salvation, I have helped you. Behold, now is the accepted time. Behold, now is the day of salvation. 2 Corinthians chapter 6, verse 2. What time does your lecture start? I, I hope you're not late. Um, my lecture actually started about an hour ago, so I'm actually an hour late. I'm actually going to submit my assignment. Um, and when is your assignment due for submission? Tomorrow. Um, if I can't submit it today, I'll submit it tomorrow. Okay, but fits perfectly well into my plan. So. Because I was hoping I could take you to a function at the community church where I serve. Um, but before that, I was hoping to, you know, take you to the mall, shop for you a little. Me? Uh, how sure are you that I'll follow you to the mall or that I'll wear all the things you want to buy? <laughs> uh, because I believe. I strongly believe. I'm surprised you didn't believe me when I told you you're alive is about to change for good. Come on, relax. I am Let's no go. longer in a hurry. After all, I couldn't have gotten into any vehicle that is faster. Besides, his car seems to be the only one at my disposal. Is everything all right, Sister Miracle? <laughs> yes, I'm fine, thank you. Um, if you don't mind, I would like to get uh, petrol at the filling station down the road uh, and we'll proceed from there. It's okay. Um, thank you very much for the ride. You're most welcome. So, um, I was told that things didn't really turn out as it was supposed to between you and your husband. I mean, what do you mean by that? Look, I won't have you sit here and talk about my marriage this way, okay? 
I am sorry, but I, I uh, 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 uh. You said God sent you to help me. So why don't you just focus on that mission? After all, there is no marriage without its problems. Every marriage has its problems, okay? I mean, what am I even talking about? Marriage comes with different accessories. So if you don't have it, you go shopping for it. And if you can't afford it, then you sleep on your bed like that. After all, marriage is not a bed of roses. Well, dear, you do have valid points, but you can only reason like this when your partner is completely in love with you. Uh, we both of you are on the same page. Right? Can you comfortably say he loves you just as much as you love him? Well, I really don't understand what you mean by that. But what I know is that men have a way of hiding their emotions. Because if they show it, they are termed weak. I love my husband. And I show him love. Whatever he decides to do with that, it's not my business. I don't bother myself about it as long as he respects me. At the end of the day, every man is going to be accountable for himself. I mean, even the Bible says, every man will stand accountable to God for himself. I meant what I said because lately, I've concluded that my husband never loved me to begin with. I did not love him initially either. But the moment I said I do to him at the altar of a living God, I made up my mind to love him even more than myself. <sighs> this man is reminding me of what I already know. It's like telling me that I am finished with my husband, still clinging to him in the face of all the humiliation I face daily is being foolish. The Bible, after all, condemns foolishness. Oh, uh, yeah. Good afternoon. Good afternoon, sir. Good afternoon, ma. Welcome to our boutique, ma. Thank you for coming. Thank you. Thank you. Um, miracle, from this moment on, your life has changed. From today, you stop knowing suffering. Yes, you've been through a lot. And I feel that you need someone who can give back the love you give as much as you give it. You have been through a lot and you deserve someone who will return His hand is love. like fire passing through and consuming my entire body. And my whole body is like a receptacle. His voice. His voice is so mesmerizing. I almost cried out for him to stop talking to me like that. You demon. I have been deceived enough to know how you men start your evil cajoles. But certainly my entire body chemistry is saying the opposite. I've never been that sweet-tongued by any man before. Not even my husband has ever spoken to me calmly. Mm. Um, so, whatever it is you want, go ahead, make a pick. You can have it all. Yes. Having difficulties, all right, I will help you. I will help you. <laughs> yes. Let's see. What do you think? <laughs> um, we can try out a couple. Maybe I should go right away and ask him to say more sweet things to me. No miracle. We have to pull okay. ourselves together. After all, you don't really know him that much. Nobody wants to. Be another man still. Everybody wants to breathe and live free. This is not about gender or equality. It's all about being human. Yeah. I just want
I love this. I totally, totally love this. And I think this would look perfect on you. What do you think? <laughs> right? Uh, what else? Come on, Miracle, don't just stand there. Make pics. I'm sure you see something you like. Yeah, um, Sister Miracle, welcome to my neighborhood. Um, I'd like us to get home first, you know, try out some of the things we picked out for you. Oh, wow. Thank you so much. You're welcome. This your estate is beautiful. Thank you. Pray for me, Working to obstacles. Hoping for the best, expecting the worst. Oh, yeah. And every single day, and every single night, I'm praying. Preaching for answers. Welcome, sir. You gotta believe in yourself. Get up and go. Make your dreams come true. Yeah, 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 yeah. Life is fun. You don't have a chance to leave it. No, 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 no. It's fine, it's fine. Someone, <laughs> someone will get this for you. Are you sure? Very sure. Let's go. This is more confusing to me. The dawn is here, but maybe, just maybe I am dreaming. I used to be the one who will usually do everything by myself, including washing the dishes, going to the market, and even keeping the home clean. And now, ordinary to pick up the dresses, he says someone will do it for me. Hmm. He was right. Something is happening in my life. There is this inner joy springing up. It's like I was in the dark or perhaps asleep all along. I could feel the dawning of a new day in the air. Here I am in broad daylight and going back to darkness is not possible anymore. I will sure walk into this light as it leads me. Welcome to my house. Wow. I've never seen this kind of house before. You, you have a beautiful place here. So beautiful. Thank you. 
exactly how I've always wanted my dream house to be. This is your place now. Relax. Everything here belongs to you now. This is a fairy tale. It cannot be real. What is happening to me? It could be real anyways. Do you mean everything you say? I meant everything that came out of my mouth. Everything. Wow. Wow. Good day, sir. Ah, good day. Good day. You're welcome. I'd like you to meet Madame Miracle. You're welcome. I also like you to fix something for both of us to eat. So, what do we have in the house? There's jollof rice and chicken in the fridge, sir. Okay. Um, baked chicken and jollof rice it is. That would be good, sir. Um, a minute. Um, get the things in the car. Okay. Right away, sir. Come on. Henceforth, this will be your own. This is unbelievable. This is too good to be true. But I don't even know his name. Why haven't I thought of asking him of his name at you least? You like it? <laughs> <laughs> um, okay, so um, I would like you to try on the things God for you. So I can watch you wear them. I really love this. You can tell that this was specially designed for you. You know what? This is exactly what you wear to the function later today. The one I told you about. Okay. Great. Um, I will need to hurry back to work now until I can handle for the day. See you much later. You can take a shower, have dinner, and wait for me and we'll go to the function together. Okay. Well, nothing. I don't like going to functions late, so please be ready. Okay. Yeah. 
the food is served, would you want to come over to dine? Oh, I would like to eat here, please. is really good. You're yeah, a very good chef. Very good one. What's your name? Listen, you are not my boss's wife and you cannot order me around. For your information, my boss's mom has got him a beautiful dancer of her wife. So, just eat your food and get the hell out of here. You need to hurry up before they come and kick you out. You're nothing but a bloody gold digger. See, I didn't even know where my boss picked you up from. Hey! Who are you and what are you doing here? My name is Miriam Kuma. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Uh, what kind of relationship do you have with my son Ogadi? Eh? I am asking you, I said, what sort of relationship do you have with my son? Um, I'm sorry, Ma. I do not know the kind of relationship that I have with your son. There is no cause for alarm because I don't think I'm the person that he should be asking that question. You should ask your son of that because he's the one that does it. She is my wife. Who cares for me? Isn't she beautiful? No, 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 son. Please don't do that. Look. Look at the beautiful wife. I brought for you to marry. Eh? Just look at her. Eh? Isn't she beautiful? Hey, are you? Look, I do not know who you are, and I don't want to know who you are. Get out of this place before I ask him to deal with you. No, no, you will do no such a thing. Mom, I have waited a really long time for Miracle here to realize how much I love her and how much I want to be with her. Thank God. Thank God for today. We crossed path. And now she's in my life for good. And I am not going to lose her for anything. Well, and as much as I love you dearly and respect you, you certainly cannot make me lose her. No. And if you do not accept her, that's fine by me. But be ready to lose me. I do not pray it comes to that. What I pray is that God touches you so that you see what I see in her. Uh, Mom, you may take your leave. Huh? All of you. And I do not ever want to see her in my house again. Uh, my husband, you, you cannot ask us to leave. We came all the way just to be here. You, 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 something can be sorted leave out. My house, 
I need you to get out of my house now. Brother, even me? I said leave my house! I'm, I'm your sister. And as for you, my Jack. Besides working for me, you are my very good friend. I confide in you, you know, practically everything I do. But what did you do? You threw it all away by betraying me. You should have respected my choice. Even if you didn't, you know, you should have spoken to me before inviting my mother over. Well, it's all good. Um, I'm sure my mom is capable of paying you even more attention. So, you're going to your room, pack your things, and leave my house immediately. I'm, I'm sorry, boss. Please forgive me. My Jack, leave my house this minute. I said leave my house! stunning but my love I would like you to put on that special gown the one I selected for you can you do that for me my queen as your lordship pleases beginning to realize what it really means to love and be loved. I can't imagine him fighting and defending me before his mother like he just did. No man has ever fought nor defended me this way. Not even my husband. This feels like I'm a princess on her way to becoming a queen. Dreams can come true. They can come true. Dreams can come true. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Dreams can come true. You gotta believe in your dreams. Dreams come true, huh? Yeah, 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 yeah. Oh, yeah. Pray for me, because Working to obstacles. Hoping for the best, expecting the worst. Oh, yeah. And every single day, and every single day, I'm praying. Wow. You look so handsome. And you look stunning. True example of an African beauty. Thank you. Shall we? I'll see you. She don't wanna be nobody punching back. She don't wanna leave under the circumstances. She just wanna have a little life. You know, dreams can come true. Oh, oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. 
good. Nobody wants to be another man still. Everybody wants to breathe and live free. This is not about gender or equality. It's all about being human. I just want to live my life the way I cherish. You can understand, cause she don't walk in my shoes Don't tell me to be quiet Cause the voice in me is crying now Dreams can come true Dreams can come true But you gotta work it out Believing in yourself Um, Sister Miracle, I would like you to do me a favor. Okay. You see, um, your old clothes, I would like you to gather them um, so we can give them to charity, less privileged. Okay, I can do that. I'll gather all my old clothes and give them to charity. Good. Good. I, uh, I'm pleased to hear that because uh, I intend to get you more things. Okay. In fact, the more you give, the more you get. That's really good to hear. As a matter of fact, I've always wanted to do charity, to give to the less privileged. It's just that I barely had enough for myself. That's what I couldn't do it. But I mean, you're such a great man. You are everything I've ever wanted in a man. And I'm so blessed to have you in my life. something now. Hurry up, hurry up. It will soon, will soon start. I believe in God, the Father Almighty, creator of heaven and earth, and in Jesus Christ, the only Son, our Lord, who was conceived by the Holy Spirit, born of the Virgin Mary, suffered under Pontius Pilate, was crucified, dead, and was buried. Sent into hell, the third day rose again from the dead. He ascended into heaven, sitting at the right hand of God, the Father Almighty. From there shall come to judge the living and the dead. I believe in the Holy Spirit. Only Catholic Church, the communion of sins, the forgiveness of sins. Father, what in heaven, hallowed be your name, your kingdom. I was thinking maybe I should join them to clean up. Are you sure about that? Yes. Okay, um, I need to check something else. Okay, all right, no problem. Hey, let me help you. Let me, let me handle this. Okay, all right. Of your own view. 
Honey Mary Mother of God, pray for us now and all of us. The very full of grace, Lord, is to be blessed with our own women and blessed with the Lord. Good day, sisters. Brother, come and join us. Oh, thank you so much. I'm so sorry. Um, okay, um, I saw you were praying and I felt led to have a word with you, if you don't mind. You see, prayer must not be rushed. You must know what you are saying and why you are saying it. Prayer is a relationship with God. And as you know, relationship is about two people, two or more people, right? So if you and I are in a relationship, we learn to relate. It's the same thing with God. When you're praying, you have to learn to relate with God. As you speak to him, you allow him to speak back to you. Do you understand? Otherwise, every other thing you are doing is ramble and noise making. You see, the word composed of the rosary is biblical and must not just be said as if it has no implication on our lives. The mystery of the rosary is said slowly so that it has impact in our lives. You see, when I'm meditating on the first joyful mystery, which is the Annunciation. I think about the announcement. What did the angel say to Mary? Why did God choose Mary of all the virgins in the province? So now, when I'm meditating with my rosary, I ask God for high favor for myself and whoever that I am praying for at the moment. That way, my prayer becomes very beneficial to me and any other person that I am praying for at the time. The Word of God is very impactful on me and for all of us. And it begins to transform my life regarding whatever I need to change or whatever God is asking me to change at that time. Sisters, I could go on and on about the, the, the blessing of the rosary and of the Bible, but because we are pressed for time and service will soon start, I'll have to end it here. Thank you so much for the scarf. I'm so sorry. Next time, I will come with mine. I'll give it to you before I leave church. Thank you. Thank, Thank you. you. Thank you, Mary, oh, full of grace, Lord, is with you. My service and my work in church is not defined. Meaning, I can function in any department that I see any delay and speed things up. I am practically everywhere and God is helping me and I am good in everything. Oh, you're still here. I thought you had gone. Oh, we're still here. Um, Oh, Daddy went inside to pick up something, I presume. Oh, okay. Um, actually, you see, I had hoped that Brother Ogadi was going to pick one of our, you know, our many sisters in church as his wife. Well, I'm surprised that you appeared here as his wife. And I have actually been, you know, worshipping here faithfully, hoping that one day he was going to propose to me to be his wife and seeing you with him I know it will never happen <laughs> don't mind me just just kidding at least you're not his wife so and you're my best friend 
obviously, I'm still part of the family. <laughs> Thank you. You're welcome. And please, you know you have fine, fine dresses. Hope you're gonna pick some for me. Sure, yeah, definitely. I'll bring some for you in the next meeting. When next I see your beauty. <laughs> okay. Yes, take care of yourself. I will. Bye. Is crying. I don't know what's wrong. Mom! 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 Mom, wake up. Ebuka is crying. I don't know what's wrong. So, all this has been a dream? Ogadi is not real after all. So, this has been an illusion? Ogadi, why flaunt riches before me? I mess up my mind. I was not rich after all. I am still the wretched me with my poor and pride ridden husband. I am still in my battered marriage with the same I don't care husband. Mom, still waiting for you. Oh, okay, okay, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. What did you say? Look, I'm crying. I don't know what's wrong. Oh, okay, please. Beat up people, but you just can't let it go. I just hope that you will be alright. Such a beat up people. But you just can't let it go oh, oh. I just hope that you will be alright When that fever comes up at the midnight I just hope that you will be alright When the rain comes pouring in the morning What is God trying to show me through this dream? And who is this man, Ogadi? Hmm. Anyway, I am happy to see my children again, even though I did not look for them in the dream, as though they were happy where I kept them. I just hope my husband turns a new leaf. But you were never gonna link up It is love at the first sight That's put me on a lockdown Now I know Now I know Now I know, now I know. So I keep trying Keep pushing, keep going, everything is gonna be alright, keep moving, oh yeah, yeah, keep going, oh, keep believing, everything is gonna be okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. Everything 
is gonna be alright. Be alright. It's gonna be okay.